Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, we're back on our quest to find a shiny Dredagon. Um, oh, no, weird. Well, we... Oh, oh, yeah. right. I remember that thing. That's fine. We can get back there easy. But unless I go the wrong way, then you know. Oh no, this is fine. That that works. Yeah, okay. there are multiple right ways. Well, that's the exit right there. Mm. <laughs> so, what do you think of my theme song? <laughs> <laughs> what a geek has a soundboard hooked up now. Yay. Oh, I don't like his beard. I don't either. I'm not really sure how to make heads or tails of it. Like, did he use some just for men and paint his stubble ginger? What happened? I think he might have just tattooed his face. You think? Also consider that his overworld sprite looks nothing like his in battle uh, model. Uh, Sorry, Bayonet is just ghost? Just ghost, yes. Is fairy good against ghost? No. No. Giga Drain. I can never remember exactly what fairy is good and bad against. It's good against... Dark... Fighting... Or is it bad against so fighting? Good. Yeah, no, so, so far, no, you're good. good. It's bad against... It doesn't work on steel. Well, it's not very effective against it, but yeah. Okay, it's bad against uh, poison. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, sorry, it, it said it was a grass type, strength. right? There's one more strength. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I guessed fighting and dark. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's good against dragon. I remember that. Yeah. Yep. There yeah, we I think go. That's it. Okay. See, I gotta learn these things because I I've barely played anything that has fairy type in it. Wow, I thought I'd do a little more that than that. That was super effective. <laughs> yeah. Leap is one of the defensive uh, evolutions. I could be wrong, though. I will use fly, because if I remembered right, I put a flying plate thing on Talonflame, which I almost definitely didn't remember to do. Yeah, Leafeon's best Ooh. stat is actually his defense. Huh. I don't know uh, much about Leafeon either than just what it looks like. I wouldn't have guessed that, considering, you know... Leaves aren't known to be very strong. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not really sure why they picked defense. Maybe it's because none of the other types had really high defense. Umbreon is the most tanky. Um, Doesn't Vaporeon it, have decent defense? That's when it's special defense at 130, and defense is 110. Like, each hmm. Evolution excels at one stat, and then has a secondary stat that's also pretty good. Hmm. Mm, is a fan, I think. Has good special attack, yeah. I don't have dark glasses, do I? No. You're looking for black glasses. Sorry, black glasses. I have black belt, and he does have a fighting move, so I guess it's better than nothing. I'm just trying to figure out what little things I can hand off to people. Do I did forget the sky plane. Do I not have what, sorry? Soft sand? I don't think I do. Uh, I will check while I go back into the menu here. Soft sand, not looking like it. Bummer. I like I like the idea that one of the things you have is just a damp rock. Yeah, that's a weird thing to have, isn't it? Okay, well, Tyrantrum can't have anything better, so let's give him King's Rock. So maybe he'll get some flinches. Oh, what's that? Oh, yeah, that's that's more reasonable to make his crazy move crazier. If you put yeah. King's Rock on something fast, they can start flinching things. That's true. I could give it to Fur you or Lapras if the only thing's not holding anything. I don't have a I... silk scarf, do I? No. no. All right. Well, it'll be fine. There we go. Fine. That's that's enough. Unless Lapras, I, I don't think I have anything for water or ice. Uh, yeah, not looking like it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's plenty for now. Wow, are we really going to fight the Elite Four this episode? Maybe. Ooh. All right. I... Hi, there. talk to me. Oh, no. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, would it have done that in the base game, or is this a uh, an emulator problem? That's an emulator quirk. Okay, uh, I've never seen that one. That was pretty good. <laughs> I would have liked it if that was just regular in-game. Oh, God, I wish. 
All right, it's just Smeargle. It's not that tough. What's it gonna do? Die in one hit, that's what it's gonna do. Wonder if any of our dudes don't have maxed out EVs yet. There's a way of checking that now, right? Who's our newest thing? Uh, Tyrantrum? Maybe Lapras? I don't know. Uh, but oh, go, into Lap your, go into your menu, your Pokemon party. Uh, Here, yeah. Uh, and pick one of the guys. Dead Lapras, good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, page. What page? Go one page over. Oh, oh okay, here we go. Date map. No, maybe not. Isn't it on the training page that we can see? I was it? gonna say it's it's in the PC if not if nothing else, but it's been a while. Go back out of this. Oh yeah, oh, no. Wait. Why is it going uh month, day, year? That's uh Oh no, sorry, American. You're yeah, playing the American. Very, that's an American style. Oh god, that's weird. Yeah. I I it was really fucking me up for a second when I'm like, wait a minute, there's no fifteenth month. <laughs> that doesn't look right. Yeah. Okay, so the newest one actually is Lapras. Kay. Okay, so if we go into our super training menu, as Brandon was pointing out, and pick yeah. out Lapras, then we can see how many EVs it has. Yeah, is that so this menu? Go, that's that so, weird yeah. little... So okay. it's still... Um, it, it's almost there, but it isn't quite yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah, it, it is really just Lapras. Okay. Good to know. It looks very sad about being dead right now. I guess I would be too. All right. What do you have? Is it anything dangerous? I kind of get the feeling we're going back into the cave again if we still have more trainers outside. If you oh. giga drain, you should be able to take it out. You think? Oh, well, yeah, it is part rock. Well, that was easy. I gotta use a Slugma in a challenge one day. I just, I figure it's gonna be horrible. Okay, uh, so that's Bug and Steel. I want well, fire. Well, can't be that horrible. You used baby Pokemon. Yeah, it's just, fire in a lot of the early games seems to be a hard type to use. Yeah. I don't know if it's specifically the type that's hard to use or if it's the Pokemon that are of that type. I guess it's kind of a combo, but like for instance, let's look at Emerald. Emerald with just a fire type would be really hard. It's not a very forgiving game towards fire types. Yeah, considering there's a lot of water everywhere. Yeah, too much water. Meanwhile, Sinnoh with only fire types is very beneficial. Uh, and you wouldn't really know that because there are only like four fire types you can get in Diamond and Pearl alone. I didn't know that uh, fire was particularly good in that game. Maybe I'll do a run one day where I use a fire type just to try it out, see how it goes. Well, I mean, I, I have used one a little bit, just like, um, what was it, Megby? I used a little bit of that in a baby run, but that's a baby Pokemon, so. Mm -hmm. I think your best on this one is poison, even though it's just going to be neutral. Okay, what is that, grass and dark? Grass and ghost. Grass and ghost, okay. Oh, it killed itself. Well, congratulations, and I'll just switch. <laughs> uh, it's like uh, Morty all over again. I think it was in the baby run. What, was it in the baby run where he, he kept uh, <laughs> sacrificing himself with uh, curse and I would just switch? I think it was that one. I can't remember. Uh, I don't know what that thing I'm fighting is, so... It's Rog and Rolla's final evolution. Oh, um, Lapras is dead. I have Earthquake on Street Sharks? Yeah, but it, but this Pokemon also has Sturdy, so I would recommend using Power Up Punch first and then Earthquake. That makes sense, yeah. If I can't one-shot it anyway. I forget, was the Street Sharks I put the Black Belt on? Yep. Yes. Okay, I gotta remember that. It's a slightly more uh, appealing opening move, I guess. <laughs> uh, uh oh. Uh, oh it's gonna be horrible. Lot. Yeah, and I mean, I used, um, what's it called? Intimidate, so. Mm -hmm. Intimidate plus a non stab move. 
There we go. Alright, I'll probably just stay out for whatever's next, assuming it's not, like, water. Oh, that was it. Okay. Wait, you can time still you? This Timio. Is, this dialogue and his face and just everything about this guy is off. <laughs> I Even know. my owned body. <laughs> his five o'clock shadow should not work that way. He also looks way younger on the map than he does, like, in yeah, that he picture. Like he's like a 10-year-old, and then all of a sudden he's 35? So does she, but she, like, her actual model looks good. <laughs> yeah. His, I don't know what they were doing with him. His stubble's all over the place. Okay, uh... Yeah, the thing, so you're gonna take a lot of damage, but you could probably stick in and be fine. I'm gonna sludge bomb and see what happens. Maybe I'll one-shot it. And maybe I won't. <laughs> you'll get close, though. Mm. Maybe you'll get frozen. No, nope, maybe just I'll killed. die. <laughs> maybe you'll die. Well. Maybe you'll die. Well. Nope. Can't okay. be a trade. Just still thinking. Uh, who's faster? Talon Flame, probably. Yeah, 100%. I'll just Flame Charge, I'll get speed, and then maybe it'll be useful for whatever's after. I don't like Glaceon's bangs. I'm okay it just with doofy. it. I, I see it. I'm okay with it. I personally would go for other evolutions. Okay. Yeah. All right, Street Sharks. Because I want power punch for this, and Intimidate will probably pay off as well. I really do like Crocodile's Warlock. Cry. Me too. Uh, I'm just going to power punch, yeah. And then use Foul Play on something you Intimidated. Oh, yeah, I guess Foul Play and Intimidate don't really work well together, do they? No, not really. Ow! Ooh, cool... Oh, come on! Well, well, it had to happen sometime, Rain. Well, if I switch, he just hits something else. I'd rather like just Pokemon Stadium's something. over. I was gonna say, if yeah. you switched into Tyranitar, you would have resisted. Eh, I'd get paralyzed. We all know I'd get paralyzed. That's how that Pokemon, works. Pokemon Stadium's over, so the luck had to transfer to something else. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. All right. Uh, I'm... Party. Sorry, what? Head smash. Use head smash. Okay, also, you're cutting out way more than before, and I think it's because it's going through voice meter and just something's being weird. Okay, yeah. one last. <laughs> that that synced up perfectly with me losing health to recoil, actually. All right, and now I've switched over to this. All right. Uh, I should use some healing items. I must have a, a bunch. Didn't I buy some ridiculous sum of something that heals me? Or was it just stupid shit? It was, yeah, just, stu it was just stupid shit, so... Okay. A uh, hyper potion it is, then. There we go. And why not one on Talon Flame? There, that'll be enough to get us through the cave. This is probably, like, the last trainer, anyway. You never know, this could be the kind of cave where right at the end you fight your rival. Oh, yeah, I didn't... I forgot about that. I mean, Gen no. 2 did that, but at the same time, Gen 2, Victory Road barely existed. To spoil it, no, you don't, you don't need to fight Serena or Sean or any of your yeah. four rivals. Oh, thank God. Do I, do I need to fight somebody else then? Am I going to get to the end and, like... No, you're in the final stretch. Okay, I was going to say, like, Lysander <laughs> comes crawling back from hell. Professor Sycamore decides to fight you. <laughs> he comes out and he goes, I've decided to use the super weapon. <laughs> I have mega evolutions. Have I told you about mega evolutions yet? MDB, big league MDB. I've come back to tell you that I've really rethought things and I just got to reiterate that I think that Lysander was right in the end. Lysander is just a, he's an all around good guy. <laughs> Lysander and Mario have a lot in common. Yes. They both like red. Uh, do you have they a reason to, to destroy yeah, the you world? Have yeah, I got crunch and I have the, the strong jaw thingy. That'll be good. 
Uh, for anyone who hasn't been watching the Mario Party stuff we've been doing, by the way, I, I started putting it all in a playlist. Just every other week we do a session of Mario Party, so... You know, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, from... By the end of the week, you'll have seen a whole game of Mario Party. Oh my god, it's so fun. Oh my god! <laughs> I can't believe we survived that. In short, watch our Mario Party videos oh, if you want so us to good. have a good time. You see, you know that the audience... The, the audience approves of the Mario Party Let's Play, and you can tell. Use Head Smash, I dare you. Yeah, fuck it, why not? <laughs> it's, we're dying anyway. Yay! Fuck them all. <laughs> what? Aww. Are you kidding me? Yeah, Aww. Umbreon is defensive, so. Man, even with our um, <laughs> payback failed, yeah, it was unnecessary. Uh, even with our... Our item powering up our rock moves, it still wasn't quite enough. Ah, uh, veritable dogfight. Well, I'll just hit it with return, and there we go. Right. You know that people have been liking the Mario Party, because one, it has, like, the most positive comments of any Let's Play I've done in ages. Like, just people are loving it. And two, the view count is comparable that to that of a Pokemon Let's Play on the channel. Which is nuts. That's the first time we've ever had a Let's Play on the channel where, on release, it's doing Pokemon numbers. Wow. So, uh, yeah, people, turns out they really, really like us playing Mario Party. And we do, too. Yep, I'm never gonna get bored of Mario Party. It just doesn't yeah. happen. It's too stupid. It's too stupid. There are enough games that you could flop, like, every other time that we do it, and... Yeah. We'll never get old. Oh, so good. All right, we've healed. Um... I probably do need an actual real healing item. Mm hmm Yeah, I probably wouldn't probably get some full revives well. either. Um, do we need full restores or... We already have all these hyper potions, maybe just a bunch of full heals? I think you got a couple of Pokemon that are over 200 HP, so it might benefit us mm. to use full restores or max potions instead. I'm just thinking You don't need my... too many of those in that case. But I don't want to be reckless with my money. How many escape ropes do I have? Okay, just want to make sure. Okay, just real quick. Yeah, just quick get a lot of full cheap. heals as well. Yeah, there's no harm hey. in it. Then, then do I have need... enough ice heal? <laughs> does a does a full does a full heal bring you back to life? Uh, no, that's a revive. Speaking okay. of, well, then we probably we... need quite a few. Yeah, definitely. Get the revives is good. <laughs> yeah, it's way more than money on anything else anyway. I mean, we're probably not using many of these items, if any, in battle. I kind of just want an excessive amount of out of battle healing items. Might use items in battle. I don't know. I kind of want to go without it. it. Just feels right, you know. Mm, can I? You can walk over that. Do you think and also, you can't anything? walk over there. No, there's like a small ledge. You can't just jump over that little. How brick, annoying though. is no. that? I know, right? What, what, just imagine like... that in real Whoa. life, having to go through a puddle. Yeah, that sucks. Also, that just looks like a fucking wall. It looks the same as every other wall. That's mm -hmm. incredible. That's so Wallace. weird. And it moves very fast. I'll say you caught me. I'm a raging wallist. The Elite Four waits for you at the Pokemon League. I'm just walking around here in this big empty room, <laughs> doing nothing in particular for the rest of my life. I like that he told you their typings. Yeah, he yeah, did. Yeah, giving I, you a hint I, right before you get locked off to the Pokemon Center. Fire, water, steel, dragon. Uh, you can battle them in any order. Okay, hold on. Univa rules. Have that in front of me then. Water, what? or sorry, fire, we're good, we have Lapras. Water, we're good, Roserade. we have Roserade. Steel, we have Street fire, sharks. we have fighting, we have uh, ground. We got a lot of stuff for that. And dragon, we have fairy, and we have ice. Okay, I'm and feeling dragon. pretty good. And dragon, yeah. Okay, we we actually has a have a decent um, chance at this then. And the champion does not focus on a particular type. And we can fight them in any order. Can I not look at these? I don't remember no that dialogue. at all. Oh, that's a bummer that I can't, like... I want to know what they're all about. Maybe a little flavor dialogue on, like, champions no. of the past or something. That'd you be know, cool. It, it would just be on Mega Evolutions. Yeah. I wish that Pokemon would spend more time giving some attention to champions of the past and having, like, a Hall of Fame that actually had, like, made-past champions in it. 
I think that'd be pretty cool and add to the legacy, you know? Oh, I didn't... Okay. I mean, it looks like a unique character. I just didn't know that I was walking into the fire thing. Or else You're I would not. have Lapras first. Oh, okay, good. I... Okay, I'm so confused. She's just giving you a monologue before the actual fights begin. Okay. The hero who destroyed Big Bad Team Fire... I saved the world. There shouldn't be no quotes over hero. Big uh, well, hero Malva MVP. There, Malva <laughs> there is actually the last of uh, Team Flare. Like, she she was part of Team Flare. Oh, so she's like a known domestic... T I shouldn't use that word. That'll get me demonetized. <laughs> <laughs> She yeah. was also the um, the lady who shows up on those Holocaster, um like announcements. Mm -hmm. The the news lady. Oh, oh, was she the news lady? Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I was gonna say domestic, but no, they actually tried to destroy the whole world. Yeah. So she's well, the, a, an international. Still, mm -hmm, that word. They're still domestic because they so, are from this earth. So it's okay. not easy to tell which one is which here, but yeah. top left is deal, top right is fire, bottom right is water, oh. bottom left is dragon. It's lightly colored. Yeah, I was looking at those, and I was trying to figure, like, is that one fire, or is that one fire, and is this one water, or is this one water? <laughs> could, you, could you have made them a little more different, guys? This sounds like the argument for Cloud Strife's different costumes in Smash because they're all like very low saturation. Oh. Um, and also very dark. There's very little different about each one of them. Same with what? Sephiroth, actually. Weird. Why would they do that? Yeah, but Sephiroth has the shirt off. <gasps> what a hunk. <laughs> shirt off Se Sephiroth. That's my other name, maybe. <gasps> um, What was your... <sighs> What was your uh, Twitter name? I want to say like a week ago. I don't know if it still is today, but I remember seeing it randomly and it made me laugh. What an ask boogoo? No, it was a different one. Uh, I think it was what a sleek. What a what a sleet. What a sleet. What a sleet. Was that it? I think so. That's the one I just had before I changed it right now to what a hunk. Okay. <laughs> All right, on the next episode, everybody, we start fighting the Elite Four. Until next time, have a nice day. See ya. Bye. Thank you. Just in case.